So if she breaks it, put her back where she broke it, which this is my general area. So if she broke it and met me here, I'm not gonna resume here because then she made the decision to say, hey, I'm gonna break it when I feel like it and I'm gonna come closer because you'll listen to me anyway. If I said stay here, we're going back to where I said. It's about duration first is because if I can't get her to do 30 seconds or 15 seconds, we're not gonna be able to even walk away because it takes time to walk away. Plus you're making it harder when you leave her. And I always come back to reward her. I don't want you guys to stretch like this because you're gonna make her get up. If you're coming down to reward her and she starts to like get up to take the treat from your hand, take your hand away, make sure she stays in that, in that down before you reward her. I always made her come to me to get the treat. So, yeah. and stay, and then come to me to get the treat. Mm -hmm. So that's probably what the problem was. Yeah, I, I couldn't get her to stay because she, was get, she wanted to come to me to get the treat. I see this often where dogs will anticipate what you want from them. Mm -hmm. So if, if you've always done sit, stay, come, or okay, when I say stay, she's like, when? When? Like, when can I break? And then they just break early. When I say yes, I'm coming to you to reward you. Okay. Until I, unless I said okay, or unless I said come, mm -hmm. you should be staying put. And if we have a history of putting her in a stay and then saying come, I would say for now, don't do that. 